What's up, Knockboy Nation? Sean Fagan from Muay Thai Guy and Jason from Diesel Gym, also known as a Knockboy Ninja. He's going to show us a couple southpaw variation combinations that I think you're going to like. All right, starting off. So I like to set up a lot of my techniques by creating patterns. So I'll start off with that low kick. Well, I'm getting thinking low, thinking about that low kick. Then I'm going to fake as if I'm doing a low kick, lifting my knee up within his sight. And I'm going to land into a hook and pivot around. So from now, I'm in a southpaw position and I'm in a good angle to land a good rib kick. It's a good position because it's hard to block at this angle here and it's hard to check as well. So it works almost every time. I'll set it up here. Oh, I'll come in, his hands will drop. I'll land with that hook and then I'll finish off with that left body kick. Okay. The next one, I'm going to start with my right cross. So I'll do a cross, he'll cover up. As I do that cross, I'm gonna step through and I'm gonna do a kick to the body with my left. Okay, so I'll go one step and kick and then I'm gonna land in south foot. So now I'm gonna throw a left cross and then I'm gonna do another left body kick. So it's a weird pattern and it gets them thinking about it and it confuses them because they're not sure which leg or which hand you're gonna punch into. So from here, I'll use that cross to distract him, he'll cover up. At the same time, I'm gonna step through nice and quick, land that switch. And when I land, I'll land back and I'll shoot off the back foot into a left cross now. And then finish off with the left switch and resume my normal stand. So again, both, both of them one more time. So starting off with the low fake, boom, knee up, hook around, come across the side. Then I'm gonna start off distracting with that right cross, boom, step in, back, cross, and then finish off. I uh, hope you liked it. Uh, let us know what you think in the comments and Enjoy.